Hi, my name is Hilde and you're watching the first video about my journey with mind change. In this series of videos, I will be completing the course of mind change and rewire my brain because it's time to leave all the physical or the mental discomfort in the past and finally become the person that I deserve to be, a healthy and happy person. But before we jump into the course, I just want to quickly tell you the background story of how we ended up at this point. Back in September 2021, I got a cold and now, one and a half years later, I still have that cold. And unfortunately, it's just gotten worse over time and it's really affecting my daily life because I have a runny nose all the time. I have coughing fits that affect my sleeping and thus affect my whole day. And I won't go into too much detail yet, but long story short, I've seen many specialists, over eight different people, and both Western and alternative medicine. No one seems to find any answers. I know that this, this feeling is real, but there seems to be maybe nothing wrong with me. And right now, the only solution that they have is to operate on my nose to make it a little bit wider and I really don't want this because it feels like a very radical solution um, especially since there's nothing sure of what's going on and there's also no guarantee that that operation will actually help me on the long term but then a few months ago I was listening to the Ellen Fisher podcast and she had Heather and Kent as a guest they talked about mind change and it was a very interesting conversation because I hadn't heard those things before and it was a little bit confronting too. But it also gave me a lot of hope because their story was super inspiring and I got the feeling that actually there might be nothing wrong with me and actually I might be able to change my narrative just like they did. So that's how I ended up here. With all that being said, I think it is time to begin the course. All right, so I just finished the first part of the course, the introduction, and I just think that this part is already so motivating and reassuring. And the stories that they share are very open and transparent, which I appreciate. Um, but without going into too much detail, because it's not my story to tell, I just want to say that if people are capable of doing these amazing things and changing their life in in such an incredible way, then I should be capable of fixing whatever is going on too. And so much more even. But besides inspiring, I think it's already a little bit confronting too, because I knew from the book that most of the things that we do and our thoughts are coming from the subconscious. But just hearing it again and with all the examples that they give, it just makes me feel a little bit uncomfortable because uh, because I'm doing these things to myself each day and I really want to change but I just don't know what I'm actually doing because I'm not consciously thinking or doing the things that I do so it makes me a little bit uncomfortable but also very excited to learn about how to actually change it. The good news is that according to them I can change and I can create the life of my dreams so let's see where that will take us. I'm going to end the video right here. I hope to see you in the next video where we will be talking about the brain a little bit more. And thank you for watching. Bye.